That's how it's going to welcome back to Justice Drink Reviews. We're back at it again with another brand new review just for you guys. And this one is an absolute monster. Hit the like button, subscribe, comment, and tell me what you think and how rough this would be. Because I'm going to tell you how it is. We have Everclear here on the side. 151 proof. Alright. Then we have our newly bought Buffalo Trace White Mash and white dog mash right there and it is 125 proof so 151 and 125 puts us at 276 276 all right and just because this is going to be so strong um <clears throat> we're only going to do a shot of each which sounds sounds like a lot you know but i'm actually usually we don't measure we just pour and go for it but this time we're actually going to do a shot each Wiping off the side there, I dribbled some. They're both clear, so if you was waiting for a reaction, there ain't gonna be one. The only reaction you're gonna get is my esophagus burning out. <clears throat> Oh, that like jump started my chest. <sighs> Holy shite. Just smelling it made my arm hair stand up. I probably should have halved it. Oh man, that could that could run a car. I don't suggest this for anybody out there. Disclaimer, I wouldn't do this, you know. Um, I wouldn't even say I'm a trained professional, but, you know, trained professional here, you know. Actually, hang on. That actually ain't bad. It burns. It burns the lips. It burns the throat. It burns the tongue. But flavor-wise, it's very corn. Obviously, they're both white. They're both straight from the steel, you know? Um, but I think I'm getting more of that sweet, sweet corn that actually uh, Buffalo Trace used because it was a more... I got like a buttery corn from the... Um, buffalo trace so i think that's where most of the flavor is coming from is this one because we all know everclear is just harsh it goes down real rough and scratchy this didn't scratch at all it was just heat it was hot um that's crazy i was honestly expecting it to like tear me a new one but net i'm hot and sweating now um but that's just off the first I mean, like I drank half, so that's probably shots worth. That's crazy. That is crazy. You can kind of feel it at the very bottom of the throat. You know, it's not really <clears throat> thick. I can kind of like if I uh, adjust my throat, I feel it more. But overall, on the palate, it doesn't leave anything other than the, obviously the pungency of the smell. But like, it's not dry. It kind of, it has a similarity to gin, is what I, I want to say it has a very interesting similarity to a gin. Hey, cheers. <sighs> 125 and 151, guys. Wow. I can honestly, this is the strongest drink I have ever made and I have ever drank in my entire life. My, I'm sweating. I, I, it's hot. My throat's hot. My, my tongue is like a tingly. Um, my lips are warm. But I can say for a fact that this drink here actually tasted better than mixing the Everclear with absinthe. 
This is crazy. I'm not going to tell you guys to try this one. Don't try this one at home. I wouldn't suggest this to anybody. But that turned out way better than I thought it would. It's absolutely, without a shadow of a doubt, and a strong drink. Okay? A very, very, very strong. I cannot stress that enough on how strong this drink actually is, guys. Okay? So, don't drink this. You know, don't be mixing these high-proof alcohols like this, you know. But, nonetheless, guys, remember, I buy it so you guys don't have to. And this is where this comes in. I try it so you guys don't have to, okay? You don't have to try this now. If you ever like, oh, I want to mix this stuff together, you ain't got to do that. I did it. So, guys, hit that like button. Hit the comment section. Subscribe. Uh, donations are all fixed up. That's Cash App, PayPal. And there's a, um, a super thanks now below. It's a heart down there now. Um... Everything is set up the right way. Guys, y'all are absolutely amazing. This was a gnarly drink, but there was a lot of people are out there. You're like, you know, you got to make the video. So that's what we did for you guys. So nonetheless, remember, till later, till next until always, I'm Justin, and I can't wait to see you guys tomorrow with Finish on Friday because it's going to be a good one. I'm excited for Finish on Friday. I get off at 8, so expect a little bit late, but if you're curious on how to get that, that notification bell is the best way. It lets you know when we go live and post videos, guys, and we don't miss a day. Y'all are absolutely amazing. I'll see you guys soon. Have a blessed night, and drink a cold one if you ain't already.